You all right, Ann? Yes. And if Howard hadn't showed up, maybe the girl would have told us where Hawks is. I don't know. I know there's no use trying that again. No, but we've got to locate Hawks. He doesn't know there's oil under Peaceful Valley, but he does know I organized the raids against the farmers so I could buy up their lands. And I don't want him telling that to Howard. Maybe he's already told him. No, I doubt it. As soon as Howard finds that out, we're all done. A fortune in oil, gone. Lawton, you've got to find Hawks and take care of him before he tells. Yeah? Well, it's no sense trailing Howard or his buddy. They're pretty smart umbries, if you ask me. Maybe so. But if they had something important on their minds and were forced to go where Hawks is, they might not be so careful. Well, that part makes sense. All right, here's the rest of it. Have Doyle, the barkeep at the Paradise Saloon, swear out a warrant for Hawks. Get a court order calling for Howard and Long to deliver him to the sheriff. That'll make him head out of town fast and give you a chance to trail him. <laughs> Work. There goes Steve Long. You might as well start talking, Hawks. You'll stay here till you do. I ain't saying I know anything. But you'd never get it out of me if it did. It's too bad. Just came to the sheriff's office. What's up? Hawks. What does he want me for? He uh, knows he hadn't. Yep. Doyle talked. He didn't. The sheriff's got a court order demanding that we bring Hawks in so he can be held to answer to the charges. What charges? I ain't done nothing. Well, I, I guess we'll have to turn him in. Can he travel? He can make it all right. Wait a minute. I'm a sick man. What does the sheriff want me for? I don't know, but he says you're guilty of whatever it is. I swear I ain't. Don't take me in. We've got to. It's a court order. But we might put in a good word for you. Would you? That'd help a lot. Thanks. Who's the leader of the Black Raiders? If I tell you, will you help me? We'll do all we can. Who's in the back of the raids? Jim. <laughs> like he'll ever talk again. We better go tell the sheriff. And before Hawks could say any more than Jim, he was shot. That's not much help. Seems like half the men in Peaceful Valley are named Jim. It's a tough break. Yes, and we'll go on having them as long as Lawton's out and around. Sheriff, I'd like to swear out a warrant charging him with Hawks' murder. All right. Lawton will be a tough one to locate, though. Well, uh, I don't mean to tell you your business, Sheriff. But if it were my job, I'd start by offering a thousand dollars reward for information leading to his arrest. Fair enough. We'll post the reward. And, uh, being as it's your idea, you and Steve can take over for the county. I know, Sheriff, but I, uh... Raise your right hands. You solemnly swear to uphold the laws of the United States in this county? Yeah. yeah. Special Deputy Howard, you're in charge of this case. Here, make up your poster. What's so funny? I wonder what the folks in Missouri would say. 
Jesse James, special deputy. <laughs> Your brother probably could sure get a kick out of that. Here's your badges. Thanks. Let's see what you've got there. What's up, Jesse? It's about Lawton. Listen, Special Deputy Howard, come alone to Moody's barn at 10 tonight, and I will tell you where you can get Lawton. Be sure you come alone. Who's it from? It isn't signed. Maybe it was one of Lawton's Black Raiders, looking to pick up $1,000 without taking any chances. I don't know about that. It don't seem to me that a raider would turn Lawton in. Well, they must have been making plenty. And if Lawton goes, it'll be out much more than $1,000. I wonder why that rider left so fast. Jesse, it's a trap. Kind of figured that way myself. Never did think we'd get an honest bid for that reward. Well, we'll soon know. Let's go, Jesse. You better take another look at that note, Steve. It says for me to come alone. No use scaring off whoever sent it. But why take chances? And you said yourself it was probably a trap. That's right, Ann. And I aim to trap the trapper. Now, as soon as it gets dark tonight... this rope while I rig up the counterbalance. What's the counterbalance for? That's to make the gun fire in case the rope breaks, so that the gun will go off with a pull from either direction. OK, try it. like a charm. Careful now, don't trip over that rope. After I get this loaded, we'll all be blown to bits. That's a little surprise we're saving for Mr. Howard. Okay, all set. We've got to get out the back way. Wait a minute, I forgot the lantern. Hold it. Drop those guns. I'll get moving. Keep going. OK, Howard, you win. But don't make us go through the door. If that gun goes off, we'll all be blown to bits. <laughs> <laughs> 